Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're diving into a common challenge faced by many developers. Our viewer asks, how can I draw on an Android canvas using multiple colors and stroke widths without everything being redrawn every time I change them? Let's break down the issue. When users want to change colors or stroke widths while drawing, the current setup redraws everything with the new settings. This can be frustrating and disrupts the drawing experience. Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To allow users to draw with multiple colors and stroke widths without redrawing everything, we need to modify how we handle the drawing path. First, we need to ensure that the path is preserved when the color or stroke width changes. This means we should not clear the path when updating the paint properties. In the draw line class, we will modify the change color and change width methods. Instead of redrawing the entire canvas, we will only update the paint properties. Next, ensure that the onDraw method only draws the path using the current paint settings. This way, the path remains intact while the appearance changes. Finally, test your application to ensure that changing colors and stroke widths works seamlessly without losing the drawn path. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To draw a path with multiple colors, maintain two parallel lists, one for paths and another for colors. When the user clicks to change color, a new path is created. The onDraw method iterates through these lists to draw each path with its corresponding color. When the user interacts with the screen, the action down event starts a new path, action move updates the path, and action up saves the path and color to the lists. Note that stroke width isn't implemented in this example, but you can easily add it based on the provided structure. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In this code, we create a custom view called DrawLine that allows users to draw paths with multiple colors and widths. It uses a path and paint object to manage drawing on the canvas. The constructor initializes the paint settings including stroke style and initial color. The change color and change width methods update the current drawing color and width. The onDraw method iterates through stored paths, applying the corresponding color and width for each segment. The onTouch event method handles user input for drawing. When the user touches the screen, the path is created and updated. On release, the current color, width, and path are saved for future drawing.
Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To draw a path with multiple colors, remember to call invalidate whenever you change the UI. This ensures your changes are reflected on the screen. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you find that solution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.